All right, guys, here we are. We've got a bit more of a difficult flue repair here. Oh, that's got a little step on it. We need to take it all out. Same with all these. We've so marked those. It's going to be a bit more difficult, but yeah, because we're working around this circular flue pipe here. Right, next step, we've cracked a few bricks, so as you can see we've gone a little bit wider than we wanted to, but never mind, that happens. When we put this back we've got to get the flue running back towards the house slightly as well. And what we can do is, as we've taken all this insulation out, we can put some more insulation from the back hole when it's bricked up. We don't need the mixer because we're only mixing a small amount. It would be a bit daft, would it, if we got a mixer? Try and get this sorted here. Might just have to experiment with opening. Yeah. So our holes filled in. I'm checking while I'm going to. If the beds are leaking okay and square, parallel and level and all that. So, leaking okay. I hope the can of worms this job really. What we'll do, we'll do a bead round the uh, flue. People leaking around. Keep an ass joints, can't we? Have another one. Okay. Yeah. That's nice and nice and wet. All right. Yeah, put your mortar on this portion of the trowel. And they're basically you just flip it upside down. It takes a bit of practice, but something like this. Like that. See? And then you can treat it from there. You learn a lot about gravity as a bricklayer. Because you work with it every day. <laughs> and you don't even notice. A jointer. And with it drying so fast as well. You won't get much time. Oh, been. <laughs> yeah. Fill them holes. I like this jointer, it's good. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's try and tidy it up there. Get in there. See if you can get it on the left hand side of your trowel and give it a bit of a flatten. Right, and then we're going underneath here. 
that end. So if you put a long way, you don't need to put a lot on, just keep going. Go this top like that. We're going to butter the brick that's actually in there. Now, if you haven't got one of these jointers, barrel jointer, I highly recommend them. Not sponsored, but this one's called Amtec. It's a cracker. I know you're thinking if you're used to the old jointer. Oh, what the hell's that? But it's really good, trust me. I was thinking the same. It's really good. It's a nice finish. Let's tuck them in a little bit, and then we're going to finish that off in a bit. As best we can. That's, that's finished, isn't it? Uh, okay, guys, thanks very much for watching. We've given it our best. It was the difficult one. Don't try this at all. <laughs> no, you can see there, it was a bit difficult to get that. And then cut some with these bricks as well. Because uh, I've uh, grinded the batteries run out. So I've had to do it with the brick hammer, which is difficult. Now, what we've sorted out, it looks all right, doesn't it? <laughs>